Section 5, Presentation and Printing. Until now, you've been working on a series of stacked design layers used to separate different stages of the process and to provide different 3D planes on which to place objects. You've also used classes to distinguish between different types of objects and to apply different graphics to their members. Now you'll learn how to make full use of all of these elements to prepare all the project drawings you need. After completing this series of exercises, you'll be able to create sheet layers and amend their properties, add a title block to a sheet layer, create viewports of your design showing it in different orientations, render a viewport using a RenderWorks style, and create a PDF of your design, and learn how to print your design. Create sheet layers. Although we set the scale on the design layer and set the page size, I've mentioned several times that it really doesn't matter about page size on a design layer. Ultimately, on a sheet layer, you can present your model from any angle, at any scale, with as much information visible as you choose on a sheet layer. A sheet layer is much more representative of a physical piece of paper than a design layer. Create sheets. Open the file 1 Start Presentation. Using the navigation palette, make sure None is the active class. Click the Layers menu on the view bar and notice you can create new layers directly from this menu. Choose New Sheet Layer. In the New Sheet Layer dialog, complete the fields as follows. Sheet Number, Sheet 1. Sheet Title, Layout. Edit properties after creation, check. Click OK. On the Edit Sheet Layers dialog, note that you can set the DPI or dots per inch setting for each layer. This setting affects the quality of any rendered images. Higher values will produce higher quality images, but they will increase the rendering time. For now, leave this at 72 DPI, but be aware that you may want to increase it later. Click Page Setup. You saw this dialog at the start of this guide when setting up your design layers. Check Use Size Unavailable in Printer Setup and then select ISO A1. Click OK. Click OK again. Return to the Layers menu to create two more sheet layers with the following settings. Sheet 2 Sheet Title Hard Landscaping Page Size ISO A1 Sheet 3 Planting Page Size ISO A1 Use either the Layers menu or the Navigation Palette on the Sheet Layers tab to make Sheet 1 Layout the active layer. Click Fit to Page. Don't worry that you can't see your design anymore. It's all still there on the Design Layers and we'll return to it soon. Notice that the Sheet Layer looks a little different than a Design Layer. It has a more distinct border and looks like a physical page. It has a scale of one-to-one -one that cannot be changed. The viewports themselves will display objects at a chosen architectural scale. Add a sheet border. On the Dims and Notes tool set, click the Sheet Border tool and then click Sheet Border Tool Preferences on the toolbar. When the Sheet Border dialog opens, change the following. Sheet Size Fit to page. Title block. Click defaults, then click the symbol preview and choose simple title block 1. Click OK and then click OK again. The cursor is now carrying a ghosted sheet border and title block. Click once on the centre of the page and again to set the rotation. Press X on your keyboard to return to the selection tool and avoid placing further sheet borders on top of this one. On the Object Info palette, click Border Settings and adjust all four of the margins of the sheet border 
to 10 millimeters. Click OK. Change the following fields. Title block margin, vertical. Show grids, uncheck. Choose text, format text, and set the style to plant tags, aerial narrow, 10 point. Click OK. On the object info palette, click edit title block and enter the following information into the fields. Drawing title, layout plan. Drawing number, GSG-001, drawn by Tamsin Slatter. You can add your own name, of course, if you prefer. Date, July 2013. CAD file name, getting started.vwx. Click OK. Notice the fields have updated on the sheet. Choose Edit. Copy. On the navigation palette, click the Sheet Layers button. Make Sheet 2 the active layer. Select Edit, Paste in Place. On the Object Info palette, click Edit Title Block and change the following details. Title, Hard Landscaping Plan. Drawing number, GSG-002. Click OK. Repeat the copy and paste process to place a sheet border on sheet 3. Click Edit Title Block and change the following details. Title Planting plan. Drawing number GSG 003. Click OK. The sheets are now prepared and ready to display the viewports.